Well, Tony, did you deserve a point for the way that you toughed it out tonight? Yeah, as, as much as anything else. I think, um, you know, they're a the good side. They, they play very old-fashioned in a lot, of, a lot of ways. They play forward, they run forward, they get balls in the box, they ask questions of you through the pitch quickly. Um, and they're, you know, they're playing with very, you know, a load of confidence. They're very enthusiastic and, um, you know, every supporter at this football club should be really proud because th those players don't have to give it a go. How good a point is it then? Oh, it's a, it's a, another point along the way. You know, it's important that we get to 40 points. Um, you know, that's seven points now at nine games. Um, and, you know, we're, we're, we're happy with the way things are going at the moment, but we have to I mean, maintain that, that desire and that hunger to get to those 40 points and then we'll look at it from there. How hard is it to repel a team with that amount of determination and almost relentless pursuit of a winning goal? Yeah, it's difficult. You know, we, we, we should have kept the ball better tonight. We, we played really well against Palace on, um, on Saturday and kept the ball and moved the ball through the pitch. And I said to him afterwards that there's most probably more opportunities tonight to, to have done the same. But it's the second game in four days or five days and we're away from home. It'd be interesting to see how many teams have actually won away from home. I know Everton did, but they didn't play the weekend. How many teams have actually gone away and won? It's, it's, it's a difficult ask in the Premiership to win that second game away from home. So really pleased with the players. They've showed a lot of character, a lot of commitment. And um, like I say, from now on in, I hope Leicester actually do it. I was about to say to you, you've denied them two points tonight, but will you begrudge them getting 30 from the remaining 10 and winning this thing? No, I'd, I'd love to see them. I think, um, as I said before, I think Forrest, a long time ago, when they got promoted from the second division, was then the first division into the first division. With Cluffy, you know, they did it and everybody said that was an astounding achievement. This is even, this would be even greater because the divide, the money, the gap between the people who have it and the people who haven't got it is enormous. So it'd be lovely to see Leicester do it. It'd be fantastic. Give people like West Brom hope, wouldn't it? <laughs> Give everybody hope.